What's going on world? It's your boy Big Chips here and today I'm actually going to show you how to actually set up a Google Hangout as well as uh, just teach you a little bit about Google Hangouts so, and why they're so important. If you are not a part of the Internet Lifestyle Network yet, you need to really, really kind of start thinking about that because what we're doing here is we're changing the game. We're changing the way that we make money even. So we're actually getting pay raises. That's pretty super sweet. But we've just got a community that is just absolutely second to none. And I mean, we're really just absolutely killing it. So you got to come in. Uh-huh, Steve's sick and I knew he'd put a video out. But, you know, it's just super sweet and what we're going on. Oh, here we go. Look at this, guys. We have a new member in the house, Miss Pamela Armstrong, all the way from Canada. So that is super sweet. So I will do this live on the air. Miss Pamela, you are getting a shout-out, sweetheart. Welcome. Uh, welcome to the fam. Boom. That's phenomenal. That's awesome. I can't wait. So, super sweet for you. Welcome to the family. But this is what we got. I mean, this is what we do. We we welcome people. We post on their videos. We see what's going on. And we get from there. I can sit here all day long and welcome new people. So, we'll do that here in a minute. So, if you have not checked out the Biz and Chips channel, go to youtube.com user or forward slash user forward slash Biz and Chips and check out Biz and Chips. I happen to think these two guys are phenomenal. And I'm not being biased at all, but I think they're awesome. So, the first step to actually running a Google Hangout is you've got to have a Google account. So, you know, of course, biznutbigchips at gmail.com is set up. So if you're on, I mean, and you can do this from your email or you can do this from anywhere. But uh, if you're on YouTube, uh, or you can actually download this super sick uh, little black menu for your uh, Google Chrome as well. But if you're on uh, YouTube or whatnot, you can come down, open up your options here, go to Google+. Plus. Now what's going to happen is this is going to run just a little slow because this laptop I'm using actually sucks. So... <laughs> Uh, so it takes a little bit of time but when Google Plus opens you're gonna see the array of stuff now what I want you to understand is if you have not used Google Plus in the last week I'd say last week they've changed it completely so this really is gonna be a new tutorial for you but basically what's gonna happen when this loads you're gonna see up here you're gonna see it says home so when you hover over it that actually opens up so the best way to do it is to go from there then come down here to the Google Hangouts on air. You can also do that by going to plus.google.com forward slash hangout. I think that, or actually they put the U and the O, so never mind. Oh, Google, you make things so difficult. But basically you come to the live on air hangout section and basically you just look right here for the start hangout on air. Like I said, it's gonna load a little slow because of the system I'm using. So what we're going to do is that's going to pop up and it's going to actually give you a new screen. So once this actually loads, I don't have my camera actually hooked up. So I don't know if this webcam on this laptop still works or not. But you're going to have the opportunity to actually name your Hangout and invite people that you want on. So yeah, that's not going to work. So we'll have to look at that. <laughs> Alright, so here you get to name your Hangout, so you can just name it uh, Google Hangout Tut. And basically you just start on Air Hangout. What's going to happen is it's going to load and it's going to get everything generating as it runs. Like I said, this is actually taking a lot longer simply because I am on uh, this crappy laptop. 
So to those who are looking at this and saying, oh my word, what is going on here? We're going to point out a few new things that are happening. Okay. Number one, you're going to see right here that this is different. Now all the users come over here and they kind of stack across this way. Now I did see at one point that they were loading differently, but again, Google's going to change it. Uh, the title you're going to see is right here. So here's your title for your Hangout. This is what it's going to say on that little menu. It's going to show you how many view viewers you have right here. Now this is going to give you your links. Okay, so we'll start that. We'll show you that here in just a second. So when you're ready to actually broadcast, you're going to click this little section right here, and it's going to tell you right here whether you're live as well as up here whether you're live. Now the one thing that isn't showing is because now these uh, are retractable menus so they actually do disappear so that's one thing that is different and I actually don't mind that at all but I'm gonna show you that so now you have your hangout toolbar here now a lot of people might not have all the stuff added so you would have to go and actually add apps so when that pops up open, you would just come over here and click Add Apps, and then you can add your, uh, I think the Google Hangout Toolbox is actually installed now, pre-installed, but like if you want the Hangout Google Effects with the sounds and the different hats and glasses, stuff like that, that's what you would use there. Now here is the two difference, and I notice a lot of people are screwing this one up, so I wanna make sure we pay attention. Like I said, there are several ways like you can actually add people here okay you can cut your sound off here and you'll see if your sound is off because it'll be red alright and you can also cut your video off when your video is off all it's gonna do is show your logo I'm gonna leave that off for a little bit just because you can set your bandwidth okay you can limit how much and this makes your video quality really really poor so I mean leave it as high as you possibly can alright uh, here's your options for your microphone as well as your uh, web camera. My webcam broke, so I have to actually have an external, but I haven't hooked that one up to this one yet. So I need to. So uh, and of course you can you can alter all that stuff there. So there's that. When you want to send a link out to people to join your webinar. All you're going to do is click up here in this toolbar, and this is the link you send them to join, and then they pop up down here, and they can actually participate in your Google Hangout. This is what everybody tends to use, and that is wrong. That is a big no-no, okay? So what you want to do is come down here and click Links, okay? This is going to give you the event page, so they can go to YouTube at this link. Let me copy this, and I'll show you real fast. And then while that loads, we will, uh, I'll show you what it looks like. And when you want to embed your video on a page like we do at bizandchips.com and like we do at the Internet Lifestyle Network, you're going to grab this code right here, copy it. You can uh, do your shortcuts, Control C, Control V. You can right click and copy. Well, you got to actually, I guess, highlight it first then you can copy it <laughs> and then you paste it into whatever the application is that you are going to use for your hangout okay so I think this is finally loaded like I said this takes a little bit of time just simply because it's uh, I've got a crappy little laptop so as you can see on this one now here here's the good thing here is the screen so see you're, you're seeing that it says please stand by starting soon. Once I hit the record button, we go live and then within 30 seconds it plays on the screen here. So there is a time delay. If people are here, they can leave comments right here and uh, actually start a whole comment section and also boost the ratings on your Hangout. I don't really care about that per se because I like for my stuff to come naturally, but I like to actually keep it on the page, uh, businesschips.com forward slash live. So if you haven't checked that one out, check that one out. But uh, let's go back to the Hangout page. 
So that's what you would do. You would embed that, and then you would send this out to people to come watch the live event, to come watch what you're doing. Not this one. Okay, this is what you send out for people to join and participate. This is the link, the event page of how you get them to come watch and watch only. They can interact in the comments, but that's that. So this has been a short tutorial by your boy Big Chips. Now, I will actually go into a more in-depth on how to actually take well let's let's do this one here <laughs> to take this video code and encode it or embed it onto a page so that just like your boys biz nut biz chips do you can do it also so we'll go into that into our next tutorial so if you are part of the biz nut big chips mastermind you will be getting that tutorial in the next couple of days we may actually do it live just so you can see it live in action live in action and we will go from there but that is how you set up a google plus hangout that is how you send out the links to have people now remember this is to join the hangout okay this is how you get them to join your hanging this is how they watch okay so keep in mind the event page is where they watch and the big link up here is how they join. So make sure you, you remember that, that you write it down, <laughs> whatever it takes. But on this one, now I will, I will say this. When you press the start broadcast, what you'll see is you'll, you'll have a timer. A, a screen will pop up. I'll show you what it looks like real fast. Screen will pop up that tells you, do you realize that you are going to be broadcasting publicly and you hit OK. I'm not going to do that because I don't want the crap on my channel. But it's going to pop up another screen. It's going to start counting down from 10. I think it's 10. It's either 8 or 10. And it will count down. And then you'll hear a ding. And then like a couple seconds later, you'll hear another ding. And when that second ding happens, you're going to notice here and here that it says live. So, and it have the, actually, funny enough, it have the red little button right there will be red. So, it'll say live and it'll be red and up here will be the same thing. And my friends, my family, this, and oh, look right here. You see how I've got it opened up on my browser? That's saying that we have one viewer. So, there's one person watching this hangout right now because that's me. So, let me show you that. I'll hang it up real fast. Go back over to Facebook. So as that gets off the page, you'll see that that one viewer should actually go away because I'm no longer viewing the actual program. But it usually does take a few seconds to go away, so we won't we won't stand there for that. But because as you see, it's still kind of loading up. But that's how you do it. I mean, it, it really is that simple. Then you get on here. You just give the world some value, give them some things that they can use, and teach them how to be successful like you are, like your boy Biz Nun, your boy Big Chips, and roll how we roll. So if you've got any questions, but if you have any questions or comments or you want me to go further in depth, leave comments below and I will actually add that in to the actual next tutorial that I do that will teach you how to embed it on your video page. So, all right. I really believe that's it this time, family. <laughs> so, guys, I will see you on the other side. Make it a great day. I dare you.
for those that actually get that. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, 